You see that raisin? <laughs> <laughs> he was hiding. Mm. <clears throat> Your name is Yvonne. Thing. It's that time again. Morning. It's that place again. Entire family vlog. Hello, little Tibbs. You look very cute. Hey. Yes. It was cold, and now since we've been here a few minutes, the sun has come out some more, and it's warming up. So that's nice. I've already ditched my coat. Probably gonna make him ditch his coat in a sec here. Sean's over there raking. We're here at one of Sherry's properties, helping her clean up. Okay, it's been a few hours. This boy fell asleep in the truck for almost two hours, I think somewhere between an hour and a half and two hours. He took a nice little snooze. I tried something different this time. I did nurse him to sleep, but when I laid him down, instead of putting him the regular way in his car seat, I actually flipped him the other way. I, I put his blanket in the bottom of the car seat close to where his feet usually go so that he could have some some support down there and then when I laid him that way it was much more like he was actually laying down instead of sitting you know half propped up and so I think that's why he slept a little harder worked out worked out pretty well this time huh Tibbs you can see Sean back there still battling the uh, cleanup this yard had so much more to rake and clean than it looked like. My goodness. We filled up her dumpster that she rented, right? Which was already uh, probably a little more than half full when we got here because of stuff that the contractor had thrown away, the general contractor. Whoa, raisins everywhere. Here. How about we don't and say we did? Thank you. Anyway, so we filled up the dumpster and now have a truck full ourselves. You can see it back there in the back. So now we have to take an extra trip to Rocky Top. But after today, this whole yard will be cleaned up and ready for the gravel that we're gonna lay tomorrow on the easement. Yeehaw! Uh. You missed a raisin. It's right there. It's hiding. You see that raisin? <laughs> he was hiding. Mmm. <laughs> mm. Yeah, I love you. Okay. Yeah. Camera. Can you say camera? Camera. <laughs> so I waited to, I was gonna give uh, the baby ice cream yesterday and I didn't because Nat wasn't here. And she wants to give him some, but here's the thing. <clears throat> she can introduce him to everything else. Ice cream is my thing. Kind of been my thing. Ask my family. Ice cream is my thing. I get protective, defensive over my ice cream. I'm going to introduce it to him. Yes. I went on dates when I was in my teens, Tibbs, because I didn't like the girl, but she offered to get me ice cream, you know? So, we're just going to give you a little bit because it's kind of cold. Try <laughs> it's it? kind of cold. Ice cream. What do you think? Oh, he's thinking. <laughs> he's trying to chew it. Did you get a little chocolate chip? You like it? Okay, hope you liked it. That was it. Just kidding. We'll give him another bite or two. Yes, feel the reverence as the ice cream slowly settles your soul. At least I'm not chanting anything. Oh, I love the ice cream. Oh, I love the ice cream. Oh, I love the ice cream. <laughs> yeah. Now, now he's just like swallowing it, wanting more. Just a couple bites. Nat better eat hers because once, once I say mm -hmm. enough, you're probably gonna, you're gonna need to put it away. You're gonna fall apart. Oh, he's gonna have a breakdown when we say no mo. 
could take a normal gnat size bite. She fills what? this spoon up. Yeah. Don't judge me. Not like that. Yep. Yep. There she goes. She doesn't stop to <laughs> like Delicious, enjoy okay. the ice cream. It's like a game for her to see. Oh, normally she puts the whole thing in her mouth. Like honestly, it's Here. more in a competition to see how fast she, how can get it down. Here is the reasoning. When Natalie eats food, she eats to feel full. Okay. Ice cream is not what so, you eat for fullness. Ice cream is what you eat for snackiness. So <laughs> like if you are hungry, Go to that kitchen and get some food. We have it there. <laughs> hey, little Tibbs. It's dinner time, buddy. He's been watching Pokemon and playing with his blocks while I cook. And we've been hanging out, huh? You guys, I just noticed that my face got a little bit of sun today. In February. Ooh. Did I hear dinner? You did hear dinner. Whoa! Dinner dance. You guys, look, I'm not married to a hobo anymore. Look at his darling face. <laughs> Still married to a weirdo, though. I just took a long, hot shower, and I'm quite happy. I have to tell you about this little kid. Um, so one of the most adorable things that he started to do uh, this past week is now he, when we pray, he normally stops what he's doing, unless it's a long prayer, and then he gets distracted. And then he always says, men, at the end when we say amen. You know how to say amen, you little turd, and it's adorable. So now at the end of every time one of us prays, we say amen, and he says, men. And it's the cutest little thing. It breaks my heart, so I had to tell you about it. You're adorable. You're a door. You're a messy, messy dorable. Is that time again? Morning. It's that place again. Cavalier block. You're not even looking at me. <laughs> I miss my spot to drive. <laughs> Bad joke of the day. We'll just start it off here. What do you call it when liberals make you a little nervous? Ah uh, no. What you call it when you feel a little nervous around liberals? <laughs> Socialism anxiety. <laughs> Uh, what they don't tell you when you start doing real estate, they tell you, they do say, hey, it's very people-oriented business and stuff like that. What they don't tell you is what that means is you better get used to lunch and breakfast. We have lunch or breakfast with somebody. This week we're having more lunches and breakfast out of our home than we are in our home. We're on our way to work now, but we just had lunch with uh, a commercial real estate or a commercial property management manager. He does several other things as well. Um, and there are several different ways that we may be able to partner with them in the future, and we're looking forward to that. But there's that. And then tomorrow we're doing breakfast for a networking meeting. And then the next day we're doing something else, and it's just like, oh. And then somebody else wants to get together, and, well, let's just talk a business over some video games. They don't tell you about this part. This, yeah, everybody just wants to get together and eat and play video games and then work out the real estate on the side. It's happened a lot. <laughs> Yo guys, I had coke today, and the coke has sugar and caffeine, and so right now I'm a little wee. Hi, Tibbs. Say hello, little Tibbs. Say I am the cutest baby in the world, yeah. Yeah, I am the cutest, yeah. He is the cutest baby in the world. Today we get rock. And we put it at the place. Oh yeah, she's going down. We told him to give us a little less than a half a yard so that the suspension doesn't break. Because you know, you kind of need the truck to work. Holy Moses. Heaven help us. So we're back at this property. We're finishing up this front area. This property was bought by somebody who's in the same program as we are. And they joined uh, the program at the same time. But she's, and you've seen her a couple times. Her name's Sherry. She was actually uh, set up a bit more than we were. So she was able to, to get going pretty fast. She bought this uh, right before Christmas and has completed the rehab 
it went up for sale yesterday and was on the market less than 10 hours um, before she sold it and made about $40,000. Um, and in the end, the, the reason it works is because of the numbers. You have to know your numbers. A lot of people get into rehabbing and kind of screw themselves up because they don't know to figure in hold time. They don't know. Um, so, so we do a number of things. We find areas like out here where people, where houses are selling fast. We want them to be on the average on the market day to be 30 days or under. <laughs> and then we run all of our numbers. What? We won't talk about work anymore. You only say that because somebody <laughs> made the... I know, yeah. she called us on it. Yeah, but we also get questions on how we're doing things, so I'm explaining. Um, we won't just talk about work. I mean, we work pretty hard. You're gonna get, you're gonna see some work, but we'll try not to just focus on work anymore. Um, anyways, so you run all the numbers and if it works, great, and this one does. And so, uh, yeah. I don't now. I don't remember what I was saying. She had it on the market for less than ten hours, went up for sale, and uh, cool. yeah, we're excited for her. What? Full asking price. Yep, got full asking price. So I know. Round two, fight. <laughs> we knocked out that last one really fast in like forty-five minutes or so. Because if there's one thing we know how to do, it's shovel fast. <laughs> Next time we go visit my parents, I'll have to show you all the home improvement projects that I've helped my dad with over the years and I've so much shoveling. All right guys, we just cleaned up. That was a lot of rock, man. A lot yeah. of shoveling. Still looks a little dirty, that's because some of it is wet and hasn't dried yet. Yeah, the dark spots are where the gravel has some wet spots. But, but we done, we out of here. That was a pretty good job. My floor, we clean it up about twice a day. And about four times a day, he comes through and it's just, he just go, takes one pass through and boom. Anyways, how's your food? It's actually really good. It looks a little poopy through the camera. It's uh, refried black beans with ground beef and rice and green beans. And yeah. Tibbs is actually eating it, which is good because he's been doing this weird thing lately of spitting out half of the food I give him. Yeah, he ate everything and now he has just gotten super picky. But now he's playing a game where he takes a bite or two, picks up a toy, goes over there, throws it over, and... Oh, he's only done one so far. My name is Yvonne. Your name is Yvonne? Uh, what did you just uh, say? Mm, no, no, I wasn't randomly <laughs> singing. <laughs> He's over there making up songs. <laughs> My name is Yvonne. <laughs> <laughs> Caught on camera, <laughs> you weirdo. <laughs> no, I'm not looking. You do your thing. I'm asleep. Now. Tibbs is over there wreaking havoc on the house. Like what Sean already showed you. But I was just going to tell you that um, it's funny because he is now starting to crawl normally where he's like on his hands and knees instead of his elbows and knees. But whenever he gets in a hurry, he still drops to his elbows and goes really fast. <laughs> it's so cute. <laughs> I would say he isn't necessarily starting. I think he's been doing it for a while, but recently it's become like his main mode of being up on all four. But yeah, then when he gets in a hurry, all of a sudden he's just like, Whoa! Plumps down and do 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 do. Plumps you, you down. You little bullet crawl. That's when you're plump and you plop down. He plumps down. Score! I missed it, but he got another one in the kitchen. Where is your ball? Let's see if he's gonna get another one. Let's see is, what the uh, tubes do. That his ball is in here. Oh, <laughs> it's definitely something in there. It sounded like it could have been his ball in there. Good job, Tibbs. Thanks, buddy. <laughs> oh, wait, it's jackpot. <laughs> oh, good job. <laughs> <He's> like, <laughs> that was so funny because I said, Hectate, where's your ball? Because he was so excited and he was like, oh, it just. Yeah, we, we, we've been playing with Tibbs for the past few minutes and got the dog excited. And I said, where's your ball? And he comes and sits by 
you know, it was like this with his toy on it. And I'm like, I don't see it behind there. <laughs> Can you smell that? Yeah, you will finally. Don't give it to the baby again then, huh? Oh. Um, thank you for joining us today. Um, come back tomorrow if you liked it. Okay, uh, subscribe and share. Good night. If you liked it, subscribe. If you liked it, thumbs up. If you liked it, comment.